I'm Adam Bradshaw of the Dram Association, and these are my three minute thoughts on the Cooper's Choice Secret Isla Vintage Distillation Single Malt Scotch Whiskey Kill Norton Rioja Cask Matured Cask Strength. That is a hell of a mouthful. Let's put some in my mouth. So, let's start the scoring out of 20. The first five points go to uniqueness of flavor. And boy, this has uniqueness of flavor in spades. So, mmm. Moroccan spice, so lots of paprika as well, really definitely smoked paprika, rich bacon smoke, dark fruits, a lot of notes that I don't often get in whiskey, um, uh, dried apricots as well with those, that really, really goes in with those Moroccan spices, quite unique, quite beautiful, um, I'm going to give this a 4.8 for uniqueness, I think the Rioja cask has brought a lot to this spirit, uh, the quality of spirit out of five is next, it's young. It's it's definitely quite young, um, but the interesting cask definitely uh, definitely helps with that, and the fact that it's presented non-chill filtered, non-coloured at cask strength, um, and I believe single cask even as well. Yeah, single cask, one of only 310 bottles. That is a great way to treat a whiskey. Um, so I'm going to give this, although it's young, a pretty decent score of 3.9. Now, the story is where it really gets interesting because... Most people won't have a clue what this is, but if you know what it is, it's very exciting. So I have to whisper this because I don't want to get in trouble. It's an hard bag. 99.9% .9 sure. All of my sources are telling me this. It tastes like this, so I have no reason to disbelieve it. Um, and that really just seals the deal for it. Um, it's a very highly regarded cult favorite distillery and getting something that is single cask, cask strength like this is very, very difficult to get your hands on. Even just getting something cask strength like this in a fun finish only usually happens once a year with their Ardbeg Day releases. Um, so really the story on this seals the deal. I would say 4.9, it'd be hard to get any better uh, than this from a current marketing perspective. Um, now the value, all being said, is incredible. Um, so everything above um, and the fact that this is $110 before tax uh, when it came out in the Dram Association is absolutely insane. I'm going to give the value a 4.8. Uh, so 4.8 for, uh, for uniqueness, 3.9 for quality, 4.9 for story, 4.8 for value gives this whiskey a total of 18.4. That is great. That means that I would in an instant bring this back into the store. This is a fantastically well-priced unique whiskey and I would in an instant bring it back onto my shelf as well. I slightly regret only buying one bottle but that just means more for the rest of you. So for those of you who picked up a bottle of this, congratulations, we're never going to see it again. Slancher.